teams are lined up and they are ready to get this third period underway. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. Stopped by the goaltender. Quick feed to Oshie. Moves it around along the half wall. Centering pass! Oh, what a missed chance that was! Yeah, he's got to make a better play there. He's done everything right. Now you just got to get the puck on the tape. Colorado's got it behind the net. From the slot, wrist shot. Oh, gets a piece of it with the glove! The Capitals take it along the wall. Textbook poke check by McKinnon. The Avs move it ahead. Colorado sliding the puck behind the net. Scores! Now coaches talk about getting to the front of the net. Make it difficult on the goalie. Take his eyes away. Man, he only can see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. Colorado's all smiles on the bench next to you, aren't they? Yeah, they're having lots of fun. Not so much on the other side where this night has been a nightmare. Puck picked up by Gerard. No, he's only one goal away, James, from his next milestone here. The Avalanche have the puck against the boards. Denies him! Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. Puck scooped up by Carlson. To his teammate! And gets a piece of it with the trapper! Grabbed along the boards by Manson. Pinned up along the boards. Taken by Landeskog. Colorado's on the attack. Washington's got possession of the puck. And the puck clears the zone. They'll be forced to leave as well. The Capitals get a hold of it. Great use of the stick here at center ice. Scooped up along the wall by Girard. Rips it. Oh, what a stop by Samsonov. Puck grabbed by Landeskog. Puts it on that. That goes off a twig. Taken along the wall by Burakovsky. Takes it to the net. The Capitals take over on possession. Colorado's performance tonight would rate among their best this season. He scores! Well, with the goaltending on the other side, you're never dead. They're now down by two. His pass was right on target and helped set up that goal there. That's his tape-to-tape -tape superstar ability. And it was a pass that was not only accurate, but easy to handle. The Avs take it along the wall. Chris one in close. Scores! They answer right back. That's a heck of a response. You give one up, you want to try and get it back as quickly as possible. This is a really good shot, but the goaltender waves at it, doesn't get the glove on it, and it goes in. The Avs have put in a complete team effort tonight, but they really look good offensively. Their arms are going to be tired from all the times they've had them up in the air here. This has been a <laughs> dominating offensive performance. No kidding. Comfer's got it deep in the offensive end. Washington's got the puck. Good read with the stick to break that up. Moves the puck behind the net. The Capitals have it from their own end. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Knocked away with the stick by Murray. And serves up a little knock on the play. The Avs gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. The Capitals have it now. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Comfer's going to the box for tripping. Who had the edge in Carlin Baines' mind? She's standing by with the answer. McKinnon's been fun to watch as he's been able to generate more offense, guys. He's getting my vote in this one. Makar's got it in the defensive end. And he regains control of the puck. And puts the body into it, a little bumper car hockey. Oh, she's got it in the offensive end. The Avs play it along the boards. In the third period. 
inside of the final minute here in the third. Shot! He scores! Short-handed! I never got many of these, I'll tell you that, James. <laughs> what a boost if you could get one. Uh, you'd expect that. The team's leading goal scorer finishes another one. He was able to score because he used his superstar ability to his advantage, guys. That's just another way he can create offense for this club. And now it's grabbed by Johnson. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Takes it in front. Stops him with the glove. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Well, they got a comfortable lead, James. I don't think this penalty's really going to matter that much at all. The Capitals win it. Picked up along the wall by Carlson. Denies him with the save. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Seattle's on deck on the schedule. How many guys actually know who's looming? Uh, more than half, I, but you'd be surprised how many people don't know who the next team is on the on the, the room. Oh, yeah, they just play the game that's in front of them. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Puck picked up by McCarr. Shot right in front. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Uh, he's going to feel he missed one there. You don't get many chances that clean. The goalie turns it aside. There's the final horn sounding, putting this baby to rest. It's like the old song goes, all they do is win, win, win. Man, it's fun when you play like this. Your team goes into a game you almost know you're going to win and they've put together a long winning streak. Well, a fun night here to call this one, and the fun ain't done just yet. No, they go back and salute the fans, and I'll tell you, when you're playing, you notice when it's great, you notice when it's not great. That was a great night. For my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us. Good night.